Now, are you all ready to play the game? Yes. yes all right, then let's welcome our first, uh, oh, oh, well, first blindfold, sorry. Uh, blindfolds, friends, blindfolds on. Oops, and sir. you may take them off at the end of each round of questioning, but don't say anything when you do. All right, we, we have our first contestant then, please. Panel, I'm not going to tell you this gentleman's name or where he is from. We will just call him Mr. X. But before Mr. X whispers his secret to me, we're going to give our audience here at home some information. Now, Mr. X, will you whisper to me, please? You will? Well, that in itself is quite remarkable. Uh, uh, tell us more. And then, then what? Now, tell me what your secret is. <laughs> All right, gentlemen. <laughs> this, Mr. X's secret, concerns something that happened to him. And we'll start with Bill. Mr. X, we're blindfolded. Is it because we would be apt to recognize you uh, if we saw you? Is it because you'd be able to recognize you? you? Yes. Uh, this thing that happened to you, Mr. X, did it appear in the papers? Did yeah. it appear in the papers? Yeah. Yes. In the last uh, few weeks? Oh, yes. Did Mr. X say we? <laughs> uh, yes, he said we. He said yes. Yes, he said we. But he did not say yes. Uh, Mr. X, uh, may I then uh, assume that you are not a Native American? Oh, we. Are you from, uh, is your place, would it help me to know where you're from? Oh, uh, Well, I'm going, are you from Canada? Oh, oui. Oui? Oui. Is, is, this, is this him again? <laughs> Quiet, yep. $20 down, $60. <laughs> it's a buzzer had buzz. It's a buzzer had buzzed on you. He's been on his show more than we have. <laughs> and for more important reasons. Bess doesn't remember. She wasn't here when it I happened. wasn't here. Oh, you well, then you're out in the me. cold, all right. So we'll go to Bess Myers. And Bill, you may remove your blindfold. I know who it is already. Hello there, old friend. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is this... Uh, He's a panelist already. He is? Yeah, well... Bill, is it something that has to do with you? Really? A secret? Well, what is it? it has to do with Bill. I certainly hope not. No. No, no I understand. I deny any knowledge of the whole thing. No. All right, now wait. Uh, we. The chair says no. I didn't hear the answer, Gary, when Bill asked if he was from Canada. We. We? He we. is. We. All right, fine. Uh, now, when you were here before, did you do the same thing? <laughs> we. Yes? Let's say this is a continuation of... <laughs> What he was doing before that got him here. Um, <laughs> was, it, was it embarrassing to anyone? No. What you did? No. Are you doing it now? Is anything... <laughs> is, anything no. is anything happening on stage right now that we should not be seeing? No. Except who you are? No. No. I see. $40 down, $40 down. May I? Remove your blindfolds. I don't think it'll mean much to you anyhow because, well, Henry Morgan, please. Do you have any... <clears throat> Pardon me, I was asleep. Uh, <laughs> the only... only uh, uh, I was trying to think back of who we had from Canada, and uh, judging by a sort of a hysterical note and a laughter uh, in answer to some of Bess's questions, uh, does this concern a family? Oui. Is it a very large family? Oui. May we? Um... <laughs> $20 to go, and we go to Eva Marie, who might just as well. Eva Marie, you might as well remove your blindfold because you weren't on the show when he was here anyhow. So That's seeing, true. seeing him wouldn't help you. No, but, it wouldn't. All right. Welcome out. <laughs> oh, uh, I really feel it's a local joke. Um, you're from Canada, mm -hmm. and you have a large family. Are your children in Dion Quintessa? Are, are, they, are children what? With the own quintuplets? No, 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 they're not, uh, not triplets or... I mean, he's not the father? 
Oh, yes. Oh, oui. Oui. You, you, are you the father? Oui. Oui. I'll show you. I'll show you something here that I'm doing. And I point. Oh, I see. You see? Yes. No, yes. no comprendre. Oui. Oui. Eighty dollars, darling. Eighty dollars to go. Let me reintroduce you to Mr. Heliodore Sear, who is back with us for his third appearance. The first time Mr. Sear was on I've Got a Secret was when he became the father of his 25th child. The following year, he was back with his 26th child. And tonight, we are celebrating the arrival of number 27, a boy. <laughs> he is from New Brunswick, obviously he speaks no English because of my use of this. And so once again, we must call upon our production manager, Mitch Leeser, to come out and interpret for us. Mitch, hi, your friend. Welcome to your own show. Now, Mitch, before I ask any questions of Mr. Sear, we have a piece of film that I would like to show the audience. Can we open the curtains, please? Now, we can watch the film on this monitor. Mr. Sear was on our show when we were on the air for Cavaliers, another of the R.J. Reynolds products. And this is the first time in the history of our show that the same contestant has made three appearances. And I believe this film of Mr. Sear's last appearance will explain how come. Watch this. And also, sir, since you were on the show last year when you had your 25th baby and are now back with your 26th, here is a contract signed for you to come back on I've Got a Secret every year just after your annual baby is born. <laughs> Now, Mr. Sear, the contract called for you to appear on the program every year. We missed you two years. What happened? Guy dit que nous avions eu un contrat avec vous par lequel vous deviez revenir chaque année. Qu'est-ce qui s'est passé? C'est pas de ma faute. He said it isn't his fault. All right. Now, out of these 27 children, do you have any twins or triplets? Est-ce que vous avez des jumeaux, des triplets de, de non. ces enfants? Non, je suis All non. 27 non. of these children were single births. So ask Mr. Sir how many years he has been married. Combien d'années est-ce que vous êtes euh, marié? Uh, 31. 31. 31. 31. Now, Mr. Sir's oldest son, as a matter of fact, is 30 years old, and he, the son, already has seven children of his own. He has been married for eight years. <laughs> Mr. Sir is a potato farmer, and with the help of the older children, manages very well. Uh, however, we found out later that his wife doesn't have any appliances in her home to make her life easier. So, Mr. Sear, if you will come center stage with me, Mitch, we have something which we think might find useful. Will you, um... Your big problem, by the way, is doing the laundry without owning a washing machine. So let's open the curtain. <laughs> This is an RCA Whirlpool. It's the world's first self-setting washing machine for you and your family, and you'll be happy to know that it has a built-in lint filter and many other features. Okay? Okay. Merci beaucoup. Ah. Now, we also found out that your wife does the cooking on a wood-burning stove, which is rather old-fashioned. So, Frank, let's fly this curtain. There we go. This is also from RCA Whirlpool, an electric range with a double oven and special barbecue. I uh, asked him if he has an electric refrigerator. Est-ce que vous avez un réfrigérateur euh, électrique? No. No? Oui. Oop. Maintenant, vous Oop. l'avez. Oop. Oh. Here's an RCA Whirlpool 13 cubic foot refrigerator with an automatic defroster. And inside... Baby food for the 27th member of the family. Sir, we'll see you next year. (laughs) Your money that you've won, the $80, and your Winston cigarettes. Thank you. Right on. He'll be back next year, too. Mm -hmm. 